So you're seated on the chair and you're having your hands on your knees. And we'll just do three rounds of the chair sun salutes together, right? So hand to heart, taking an inhale, taking an exhale. Now inhale, lift your arms up. Exhale, place your hands on your knees. Inhale, lift your right leg up. Exhale, place the right foot down. Inhale, lift the left foot up. Exhale, place the left foot down. Inhale, lift up your spine. Exhale, fall forward, drop your head and hands down. Inhale, lift your right hand up, twist to the right. Exhale, place the right hand down. Inhale, lift your left hand up, twist to the left. Exhale, place the left hand down. Inhale, rise up with your arms up. Exhale, place hands on knees. Hand to heart, second round. Inhale, lift your arms up. Exhale, place your hands on your knees. Inhale, lift your right foot up. Exhale, place the right foot down. Inhale, lift the left foot up. Exhale, place the left foot down. Inhale, lift up your spine. Exhale, fall forward with the head and hands down. Inhale, lift your right hand up, twist to the right. Exhale, place the right hand down. Inhale, lift the left hand up, twist to the left. Exhale, place the left hand down. Inhale, rise up with your arms up. Exhale, place hands on your knees. Final round, hand to heart. Inhale, lift your arms up. Exhale, place your hands on your knees. Inhale, lift your right foot up. Exhale, place your right foot down. Inhale, lift your left foot up. Exhale, place your left foot down. Inhale, lift up your spine. Exhale, fold forward. Drop your head and hands down. Inhale, lift right hand up, twist to the right. Exhale, place the right hand down. Inhale, lift left hand up, twist to the left. Exhale, place left hand down. Inhale, rise up with your arms up. Exhale, place hands on your knees. Okay, now we're going to work a little bit on hips. So today we're working on opening the hips. <laughs> okay, so rotate your right foot over to the right. Okay, this way. So you can't do like a full 90 degrees here. Yeah? So wait first. First, you're trying to get like um, sit halfway through the chair. Rotate your right foot about 45 degrees to the right. Make sure the heel is right underneath the knee. Then the left leg, you lengthen out to the left, okay? Like so. Lengthen it out. Once you lengthen it out, draw your navel in, inhale. Then lift your arms up, shoulder height. Then turn, look to your right hand. We'll stay here five counts. Four, three, two, one. Okay, you can draw the arms down. Now prepare for the next pose. So that was chair supported warrior two. Now this is chair supported and modified side angle pose, yeah? Now bend your right elbow, place the right forearm on your thigh. Draw your left side chest, left side rib open. Draw the navel in. Okay. Stretch your left hand to me and then overhead. Straight arm. And then if you like, you can look over to the left or you can look up to the left hand. Your choice. Modify Parsha Konasana on the chair. Four more counts. Three, two, one. Rise up to center, draw your navel in, left hand moves down to your left calf, right hand moves up and backward, okay? So, reverse warrior chair version. Five counts, four, three, two, one. Inhale, draw back to center and we're changing sides. So, carefully draw the feet forward, Left foot moves to the left. Right foot moves, uh, stretches out 
to the right. So your butt, if you have your left butt only on the chair if possible, yeah? Make sure you're stable on the chair, chair is stable, you don't have a wheelchair, <laughs> uh, not wheelchair, chair on wheels, yeah? Arms shoulder high, chair supported, warrior two. Look to your left hand. Five, keep the breath long. Four, three, two, one. Bend your left elbow, place the left forearm on the thigh. Stretch your right hand to me and then over your head. So right elbow right by the right ear. Okay, chest supported, Parshva Konasana. Five, four, keep turning so I can see my right side chest needs to open more. Three, two, one. Now rise up. Your right hand moves to your right calf and your left hand moves up and backward. Okay, chest supported, reverse warrior. Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, draw back to center. Draw your knees forward. Last bit of hip opener. Okay, so if um, taught this before, this is a kind of like a chair pigeon pose. So your right ankle on your left knee. So now if you find that the right knee rides up really high, stay here, keep the right foot activated and just place your right hand on the right thigh and slowly press it down. Thigh, not knee. Yeah? So don't place your hand here, place your hand here. From this up position, press downward. If you are kind of parallel to the ground, you can place your hands here, drop your head down. If you're feeling your core is strong, your left foot is well stabilized, you can fold all the way down, drop the head down. So let's stay here five counts. Four, three, two, one. Now inhale, sit up, release the right leg and change sides. So if there's any pain in your right knee just now, you need to be really extra careful yeah, with that, that pose. Okay. Left ankle on right knee. Keep the left foot activated. If your left knee is riding up, then just place the left hand on thigh, press downward. If your left knee is parallel, you can go forearms on the shin or all the way down. Okay? Don't force yourself to go all the way down. Okay, lengthen out your breath. Four more counts. Three, two, one. Okay, now inhale, sit up. Uncross the leg. Have your hands on your knees with your spine lifted. Close your eyes. And namaste everyone.